everyone welcome back to my channel so today's vlog going to be a cooking vlog and in today's video i'm going to show you how you can make russian pierogi so this is my favorite russian food as well as my husband's too so usually we make pierogi on christmas but sometimes when my husband feel like that can we make pierogi i feel like to have pierogi okay i can make it this is a very easy recipe you do not need lots of ingredients ingredient list is very simple and you just need few ingredients now let me share the recipe of pierogi with you so the most important part of pierogi is definitely a dough so i already made this dough because making a dough you know take lots of time and lots of hard work and it's worth it if you want a tasty pierogies you have to do a little bit of hard work because you need a soft dough um, so that's why I already made it. So the recipe of dough is very very simple uh, and I also want to tell you guys that there's a two kind of dough. The dough I made it's a vegetarian dough and there's other dough where you can add yeast, where you can add egg and you can add sugar too. So there's a two kind of dough. It's up to you what kind of dough you prefer or you like because we all make things according to our taste. I just made a simple dough and I'm going to show you what I use to make this dough and then I will show you what other ingredients ingredients uh, we need i am making mushroom pierogi and i already washed and peeled the mushroom and my husband going to cut it because he is a master when it comes to cut vegetables in a small small pieces so he gonna do that and then i will show you how we gonna make the pierogi so i'll see you soon so Igor, are you enjoying doing this i'm very concentrated i don't want to cut my finger off i'm not a golden ramsey so it takes me longer <laughs> Guys, as I told you, that he is a master when it comes yeah, to yeah, cutting, yeah, 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 you know, yeah. vegetables in a very small pieces. Look at this. You are. I can't do that. I'm gonna cut my finger off if you just can't be doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me to cut all this? So you don't want all these? I don't know. There's so much. It's gonna take me two hours. Two hours. Huh? Like you can cut as much as you want, like. How many pierogies you want? I don't know. So you want to tell something about pierogi? I said a couple of things, but maybe you want to give some what? opinion about pierogi. I don't know. I just this is something I like. So guys, my husband done with all the choppings. We need green onions. If you don't have green onions, you can just use regular onion and some garlic. Two or three big cloves. And here is the mushroom. It's like 900 grams of mushroom I'm using. So these are the main ingredients you need and salt and pepper. So pierogi is almost like we make samosas in India. The only difference is samosa we fry and pierogi we're going to bake. So guys, here I put my... So guys, here I put my, you know, cast iron pan and now I'm going to add some butter and some oil and then we're gonna saute onion and garlic. Just need to heat it up a little bit. Now I'm going to add onions and garlic. Here guys, my heat is on medium and it smells so, so good. And especially the butter. You don't need to uh, make it like very very brown, just saute a little bit. When it's gonna be a little softer, then we're going to add our mushrooms. So the thing with pierogi, you can add anything, whatever you like. As I said that people add meat or vegetables like you can add almost everything here but my husband likes mushroom pierogi the most so we are making mushroom pierogi so my husband going to help here because i'm filming too and it's difficult like i hardly make these kind of videos i'm also scared you know of the heat and all it smells really good right mm -hmm. so sometimes guys when Okay. Yeah, so my husband said we need more oil here. I will definitely add some butter. Just I, it's not gonna burn, it's on medium heat. So, first, I'm going to wait when this mushroom is going to be like half of the size. Then, I will add some butter and salt and pepper. Look, guys, 
you can see lots of water here and i did not add any water it just mushrooms water look at this guys can you imagine that i took 900 grams of mushroom that's why i didn't add butter that time because i wanted to see that how much it gonna be when it gonna cook we are done with this so guys here i roll the dough so thickness of the dough it's up to you like what kind of uh, thickness you like you want very thick pierogi thick pierogi or thin pierogi it's always up to you so i rolled it like this and then you just need to cut the dough this is very easy Good, good, good. Pierogi with this mushroom filling. Oh, mushroom filling. This. Very good dough. Yeah, I make it very soft. See, my husband said it's a very good dough. And good then idea. sprinkle a little bit of flour so it's not gonna stick with it. And place the thing here. And now you just need to fill the dough with mushroom. Simple. Press it. Just show it one. And guys, that's how. We're gonna make all pierogies. So this is the final outcome and my husband already tried it. Did you like it? Yes. Okay guys, thank you so very much for watching my video.